Hi, so what do we have here? This is a demo of uh, the home automation and we'll also be explaining to you guys how it works. It's made of uh, three components. You mainly have uh, the phone along with uh, the phone software. You have uh, the computer and the computer software and you have uh, the actual today device itself. I have uh, Tyson with me who will be explaining to us exactly how the system works. He's also created uh, these softwares from scratch. So could you explain to us what exactly is this, what's it called and how it works? Okay, so this app is basically called Relay Control. It has an IP text box so that you can enter your PC I, PC's IP into it okay. and then connect. And here are the 8 toggle buttons so that you can control your uh, relay board mm -hmm. on and off. I see. And information about uh, the computer software? It, it, is, it links up your mobile's Wi-Fi and the relay board. I see. Uh, so what exactly is happening over here is that the phone is communicating to the mobile, to the laptop using Wi-Fi, is that right? Yeah. Alright. And what about this board here? This board consists of 8 different relays uh -huh. which has a ratings of 125 volts AC mm -hmm. and a 20 volts DC so that you can control your AC as well as DC appliances. Mm, that sounds good. So to summarize what exactly is happening over here is this phone via the software is communicating to the computer using Wi-Fi and then you have the computer that's communicating with this device using this wire right over here. Is that correct? Yeah. Alright. So I do see that uh, there are certain buttons over here and that's what you're going to show us right now. Is this that right? Yeah. Okay, let's begin. So for example, my bulb is connected to this relay number 1. I see. And over here there's relay 1. So when I switch it on, your bulb switches on. Alright, so it's directly connected. So if I click on this button right over here, it so switches it off. Switches off right. All right. And do you have some other device attached? There's one DC fan connected over there. Okay. So for example, if I press relay number 4, mm -hmm. the fan switches on. Oh yes, I do see that. So basically, it's quite a simple and straightforward arrangement when which the buttons over here are linked to your actual relay which is right over there. Alright, so you go folks, this was an example of uh, the relay being used wirelessly in this situation. Thank you so much for explaining this uh, concept to us. So mainly what it is, it's a, it's a simple straightforward software which can be used to control, to basically switch on and switch off the appliances which you would have uh, at home. Uh, I believe you also have plans to upgrade the software so you can go ahead and adjust the fan speed along with the dimmer switch as well for lights. Yeah. Alright, so here you go folks, this is basically a nice and easy to use, user friendly software. Uh, it's something which he's just created. We would like to know from you if you're currently using something of this sort or would you prefer uh, using this software for your home appliances. Uh, also let us know exactly how much uh, would you be interested in paying for a software of uh, this sort. Uh, we will have all this information posted on our respective websites. Uh, Tyson's website is uh, gtfblogging.com and mine is uh, Mark Holmes Thornton. It will have all the information that you would require about this uh, home automation. I would love to hear from you as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.